Well, we started out this morning at like 9 a.m. on the street, right? I know. You were the first person I saw on this day. Look how beautiful you look. You're like a Broadway princess. Oh, thank you. I didn't look like that at 9 a.m. I have wet hair, no makeup, pair of jeans. But you were going to the theater. You were yes. going to the theater you love the most. What was today like for you since I saw you this morning? It was nonstop. It was like a locomotive. I tried really hard to be nervous for a little while, and then there was just no time. We did a show. We did a you know performance of Dear Evan Hansen, and then it was makeup and hair and a big dress, and here we are. And and you heard, you uh, heard your name. Yeah. So what goes through your mind? Did you look at your daughter and your husband saying, did they actually say my name? No, I heard it. I heard that. <laughs> I'm <laughs> I watched going. Patina Miller's mouth move in really slow motion, saying Rachel Bay Jones, and that was pretty great. Is it a surreal walk going up there? Like, what's going through your mind? Like, am I going to get up there? What's going to happen? Can I get to the stage? Or did you say, I'm getting there? I, I thought, I'm really glad I wore the comfy shoes. What does it all mean to you? I mean, the last five weeks, you and I have seen each other a lot. And your mind was like, you know, you were like, I think I'm going to pass out. Yeah, I just, you know, intense focus to try to, I, I get a lot of panicky, you know, anxiety. I'm sure everybody does, but I'm a particularly nervous person sometimes. So I just was trying to stay in this moment, stay in this moment, go to the next moment, you know, and just try to enjoy it. You know, people say that and it's hard, but, you know. It's amazing. <laughs> your speech was flawless. You thanked your nana. I never knew that story, that she sold her ring to get you to New York. Yeah, I actually just found out that story a couple of years ago. I had no idea where the little envelope of cash came from, but that was it. Yeah. <laughs> this is such an incredible show. Everybody, you know, every show you work on has special moments about it, but this is extra special, this show, because you were there from the very first day of the reading when you just cracked the script for the very first time, not knowing anything. No, and, and it's been, I mean, the, this character who's flawed and beautiful and a mother so close to my heart, you know, single mom and working hard and just that she's been so received <laughs> is amazing because she's flawed, you know, and, and, and so are all of us. Yeah. To have your beautiful family sitting there, yeah. what it meant to you tonight. I looked at them, your husband, beautiful out, but your daughter stunning. I know, I know. This was the best. <laughs> just hold it up for me. I'm going to ask you to spin it, but I want to know what's going on in your mind as you spin it. I think the Tony is the coolest thing in the world. Spin it and tell me what comes to mind. Okay. It's heavy, and I didn't know ever what was on the back. And it says, I can't read it. What does it say? It says, presents the American Theatre Wing's Tony Award 2. You give it back to them tomorrow. They send it back to you a week, all engraved in a beautiful and box. It has my little name on it. Where's it going to live at home? I don't know yet. You're going to have right. to come over and tell me. I'm going to come over. I'll bring a beautiful bottle of champagne or wine, and you're going to show me where it lives. Sweet. Thank you.